Hello, in this video I will show you how to fix artifacts uh, that uh, you can encounter during the creation process uh, of your terrain in Gaia. Here I have an example. As you can see, I have three different mountains that I have uh, displayed them and also I change the position of uh, each one of them to create a one big formation. However, by doing so, the transform node create some artifacts. As you can see here, for example, or here, the terrain where the mountain is, is higher than the actual plane. So this create artifacts. In fact, when I combine them all together, it seems that uh, they are gone away, but in reality, they are not. They are still there, as you can see here, for example. Here, this is the artifact, and here uh, we still have it. It's just, uh, it follows the terrain, but it's still there, and uh, it will produce uh, problems. So how to fix this? The first thing that you should always do is to connect a zero border node before your transform node. By doing this, you will fix the problem in most cases. As you can see, I have now applied my zero border before the transform node and the artifacts are completely gone. This uh, will fix the problem, as I said before, in most cases. However, in this case in particular, when I reach the alluvium node, the artifacts uh, will uh, show up again. Not at lower resolutions, but uh, from 4K onward. Which means uh, everything equal or higher than 4K resolution. I'll show you. I'm now at 4K resolution and as you can clearly see there are artifacts. However, if I for example check the erosion node before the alluvium, you will notice that there are no artifacts, which means it's a problem of the alluvium. To fix this, you must go to the parallel processing of the alluvium node. And here in the chunk size, you must increase the resolution. I recommend increasing it to the maximum of 2K, as well as the edge blending to 100%. The chunk size is simply the resolution of the various piece of terrain. And the edge blending, the higher the percentage, the smoother the blending between the terrains in your scene. By setting them at the maximum resolution, the build time will be a little bit uh, longer, but uh, the artifacts should disappear. If for some reason the artifacts are still there, even after building at best resolution, you must disable the parallel processing. However, be careful because by doing so, you may get some strange border at the, at the edge of, of your plane. So let's try with the parallel processing disabled and I'll show you what I mean by strange behavior. As you can see, the artifacts are gone with the parallel processing disabled. However, we have some strange behavior on the border edges of our terrain. As you can see, the terrain is going up 90 degrees and we don't really want that. What I recommend doing is uh, leave the parallel processing enabled, increase the resolution to the maximum and apply the changes. This is the result of using the parallel processing with the maximum resolution, no artifacts whatsoever and also the border of our terrain is uh, good to go. So to summarize everything, to fix artifacts, if you used the transform node, you should also connect the zero borders node before it and then check your erosion nodes, not only the erosion itself, but also the alluvium 
and all the other erosions at 4k resolution because uh, with lower resolution uh, usually the artifacts are hidden and then simply bump up the parallel processing uh, chunk size and edge blending if this uh, doesn't solve the problem then you should disable the parallel processing okay i hope you enjoyed this video leave a like to support the channel comment if you have any question subscribe to stay up to date with the latest videos and i'll see you in the next one eyes in the sky gazing far into the night i raise my hand to the fire but it's no use cause you can't stop it from shining through it's true baby let the light